Yeah, that's right, Steve Lawrence. Stuck on the ground here for six hours and counting at this hour. Passengers on board that 737 tell us it was forced to make an emergency landing due to concerns over a possible fuel leak, but they tell us that what's transpired in the hours since that took place has been equally frustrating for them. To recap, American Airlines Flight 1787 did he land here safely right around 9.45 a.m., but passengers on board weren't allowed off the aircraft for over four hours. They've been here over six hours in total. One passenger on board told us they weren't informed of the actual issue that caused that diversion until they were on the ground. At that point, she said the pilots said they landed due to a rapidly decreasing fuel level in the right engine. That passenger, Tiffany Menhivar, said the ride felt bumpy once they were in the air leaving D.C., but it didn't feel like typical turbulence. She said once they announced an emergency landing, her head started spinning. Are we going to land safely? Are we going to have a, you know, a very intense landing? Are we going to land? Like, so many thoughts go through your head. Um, and this being a first experience for me, I, you don't know what to expect. Menhivar was traveling with her husband and their two-year-old to meet her parents at Disney World today. She said as a result, they're out over $250 in park fees and other non-refundable reservations. She said she doesn't know if they're going to get reimbursed from that, but isn't optimistic. Now, at our last check, American Airlines said this a different plane is expected to take these passengers and complete their trip to Orlando. That plane currently scheduled to leave here in a few minutes at 524 p.m. And American Airlines spokesperson told us they're working to get the passengers on their way and they appreciate their patience, but a long day for their passengers here for sure. We're live in Morrisville. Sean Coffey, ABC 11 Eyewitness News.